He has to have some kind of some kind of weakness. Which is not what it said. <laughs> Very well, you may cross examine. We'll begin your cross examination. Set on me, what? <laughs> <laughs> I'm so concentrated right now! <laughs> and I just popped in my head like, say it. <laughs> Silhouette, but what? <laughs> I didn't say anything. You heard me! <laughs> it was like nine at night. I just just had a random can you fart in this jar for me? <laughs> oh my god! Welcome back. back. Hello. We're continuing the Maya Fey case? The Maya, yeah. Okay, yeah. And now, we're basically trying to fight back at George because he's a fucking bitch. Who? Fighting back who? Oh, okay. I, I think you said George. I'm like, what? <laughs> All right. The prosecution would like to call its next witness. This poor innocent girl saw the murder with her own eyes. Okay. Now I have evidence for this chick. She's suspicious out of her mind. <laughs> <laughs> but the witness, Ms. April May, take the stand. Stand to power! <laughs> <laughs> exactly what part of her is innocent? The moment I saw her pink hair, I was like, yeah, she's not innocent. <laughs> <laughs> really, pink hair is what threw you off. <laughs> Witness, your name, please. Uh, <laughs> I didn't even get to read it yet. <laughs> I broke it at church service. I'm winking, by the way. <laughs> well, I completely forgot I could someone do a. Uh, well, there a typical woman voice? I forgot that I gotta do the Starbucks voice. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! I forgot I can do that. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> like, I for some reason, like even though I was like put on blast, like. What do I do? I forgot for all the voices I can do. <laughs> yeah, you don't realize that you're a voice actor until you do it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Order! An introduction should not require any attention from that crowd. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh <my laughs> comes in. Those are some massive melons! What is it? Oh god! <laughs> no run activated! <laughs> Uchi Mama! <laughs> He rises up like that one Donald picture with him in the motor. Yeah. <laughs> <Exactly>. No! <laughs> what if we're afraid from waking? Aw, <laughs> uh. oh, yes, your honor. This is not good. <laughs> She's already captured the heart of every man in this courtroom. Hard, huh? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Tell us, where were you at the night of September 5th and when the murder occurred? Um, gee, I was like in my hotel room. <laughs> there you go. There you go. The Starbucks voice. <laughs> that could work. I, w I was like in my hotel room. I was just trying to vibe, you know, smoke a little. <laughs> no, I'm joking. <laughs> I checked in right after lunch. And this hotel is directly across from the Manco Law Offices? I didn't mm -hmm. That's right, big boy. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> This is the court while you saw. Also, can I have your only bed? <laughs> <laughs> Please, my queen. <laughs> Jesus Christ. It was like nine at night. I looked at the window, you know, because who the fuck doesn't look at the window every night? But specifically that time. And yeah. then, oh, I saw a woman with long hair being attacked. <laughs> <laughs> the one attacking her was the mousy girl sitting in the defendant's chair. I'm not a freak! <laughs> <laughs> oh! What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> then the woman, like, dodged to one side and ran away. What? <laughs> I am not making any sense. I am not making any sense right now. Four dollars. Twenty dollars is twenty dollars! <laughs> That's not what I said, but sure. Oh, okay. <laughs> not making any sense. Oh. Four dollars. <laughs> okay, you know what? Go kill yourself. But that girl, she caught up to her and... Way ahead of and, you. And she hit... Huh? <laughs> I'm hanging myself right now. I'm gonna hang myself into that fucking ceiling fan. I'm gonna be like that fucking skeleton that spins around on that ceiling fan. Then the woman with longer... Sorry, I'm eating talkies right now. <laughs> she kinda slumped. Just like those, any of those fucking high school girls. Fucking... <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> that is the end, fucking that's animation. That's all I have to say. Every little bitsy reason. <laughs> By the way, my, my only best username is. 
<laughs> April, May, <laughs> June, July, <laughs> August, September. Oh, I'm just sorry. I'm just imagining those big hungers. <laughs> <laughs> I'm remember there for 21st of September. <laughs> <laughs> That's in a week or so. <laughs> oh, you want to... I see. It's a kind of remarkable, solid statement. And it's. <laughs> I don't need to see any trouble with the witness. The trouble with the witness with any. Wait, Your Honor. I'm also eating Takis. <laughs> <laughs> I'm also <laughs> eating Takis right now. Yes, Mr. Wright? What about my cross examination? That's your voice. <laughs> you his balls just inverted or some shit. <laughs> I thought that small, the witness testimony just now was quite firm. Did you. That's right, I understand you, you were with. You were Ms. May's understudy, were you not? You must know her techniques, well. Mm. <laughs> her cowardly way of finding fi tiny faults in perfect go perfectly good testimonies. Hey, how dare you? TTs. Oh, Mr. Wright, will you cross examine this witness? Why, well, imagine these melons. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I'm doing it. I'll gladly proceed with the cross-examination. If only because I, ha I have a, fe a feeling Edward doesn't want me to. He has to have some kind of some kind of weakness. Which is not what it said. <laughs> Very well, you may cross-examine. We begin your cross-examination. Sit on me, what? <laughs> <laughs> I'm so concentrated right now! <laughs> And I just popped in my head like, say it. <laughs> Silhouette, but what? <laughs> I didn't say anything. You heard me. <laughs> it was like nine at nine. I just, just had a random, can you fart this jar for me? <laughs> oh my God. Oh God, I'm like headed. I'm beyond <laughs> Oh god. Uh, sorry, I'm not even laughing because I'm so concentrated right now. Yeah, but... I know. <laughs> I'm dying to my own jokes. And then, ooh, I saw a woman with long hair being attacked. The one attacking her was that mousy girl <coughs> sitting on the defendant's chair. <coughs> I'm actually dying, holy shit. <sighs> Excuse me. Oh, you can tell with all of them, and it will pop up something, maybe. How <laughs> do you know she was a defendant? <sighs> That's not why I pressed him, you dumbass! Alright. Oh, you know, she had the girlish physique. What about you? No, these things. <laughs> Look, I just. No, okay? <laughs> I don't remember what I was gonna say, my bad. <laughs> There's only one person at the scene of the crime with the short, girlish chef figure. This is me, he's bulletproof, your honor. He's right. I questioned the testimony! Hold on a minute, the testimony stinks. <laughs> what? How did you know I farted? Make it a jerk real quick! <laughs> I thought I'd be right back! <laughs> Nobody breathe! <laughs> I'm willing to bet that you're lying. I don't know how I pulled that off. What just happened? I think it just randomly happens. <laughs> okay. That was right. I don't know. Yes! What is the meaning? Somebody tell me because I'm clueless about this, I mean. They actually don't shake. Weak. <laughs> <laughs> okay. If you had really witnessed my client, Maya Fay, you would have noticed her clothes before noticing her physique. I don't know what I fucking did. <laughs> I think it just normally happens. Okay, I guess so. Also, I can believe, I just, um, a while ago, I remember what kind of voice I was trying to go for. I was trying to go for Hulk Hogan. For one of the voices, but I can't remember for who. <laughs> but I guess that kind of works with, um, uh, gum shoes, I guess. Hulk Hogan, brother. Actually, no, wait, that was, that was her voice, oh. right. I was gonna do her voice as a fucking Hulk Hogan. <laughs> oh. Well, I guess it could kind of work right now. <laughs> I don't know. No one wears clothes like this on a daily basis except her. And I'm no expert on fashion, but her hairdo do looks far from normal to me. Fuck you! <laughs> 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 How 
However, the witness's testimony meshes neither of these things. The testimony is bogus. But <laughs> Now we don't know if they're, uh, if the way she dressed was She was dressed that way the night of the murder. She was, Your Honor. I saw her. And so did Detective Gumshoe. Source, trust me, bro. No, but actually, though, like, technically he did. <laughs> yeah. What do you say to that, Miss May? Okay, wow! Now, yeah, now she's uh, gone, like, like, lost it, more or less. <laughs> what are you trying to say, you mean lawyer? I have these gigantic tits. What do you have? Oh. <laughs> it's just like, it's just like, fucking. <laughs> <laughs> like a fucking slam hog or something. I saw what I saw. Sorry, I'm kind of crunching right now. I just didn't think all the trivial little details were necessary, darling. Miss May. The court would like to remind you to please omit nothing in your testimony. No matter how big your tits are. <laughs> no matter how big your tits, I'm still doing my job. <laughs> I'm sorry, Your Honor. I'll be a good girl, I promise. Boing. <laughs> <laughs> You're just more again if you would. Damn, I almost had her. I did see everything. I did. The victim, the woman, dodged the first attack and ran off to the right. Then the girl in the hippie clothes ran after her. Fuck you too! <laughs> and she hit her with that weapon. I saw it. I did. Uh. I'm so. That that clock. Um, the kind of strange statuey clock. The thinker, I think. Well, does the accuracy of my report not uh. startle? Uh. What? <laughs> I see. I wish you had been so detailed from the beginning. Fucking bitch. <laughs> the fuck are you doing? Please begin the cross examination. But. Well, I cross examine those. <laughs> <laughs> Fun bags. <laughs> I'll be your tier three sub on Discord. <laughs> Please announce my name. <laughs> I'm desperate. <laughs> okay. Okay, that's right. Uh... <clears throat> Alright, uh, did I see everything I did? The victim, the woman, dodged the first attack and ran off to the right. Okay. Then the girl in the hippie clothes ran after her. I still think that's fucking suspicious anyway, because you didn't describe this before. Oh, well, now she's uh, adding details to it because uh, that was brought up to her attention. <sighs> Fucking son of a bitch. Uh, Alright. Uh, keep thinking. Keep thinking. And she hit her with that weapon. I saw it. Which I just realized that's an un uh, unintentional cl uh, clue. Yeah. Well, yeah. Well, no, with what I just said. <laughs> she did slip up about that, actually. Actually, wait. How does she know about that? Wait a minute. What, you know about what? The fact that she... that. The fa the movement. He only she only said that she saw her. She, yeah, the movement. She saw her attack her, supposedly. But that, you're you're, go you're going getting onto it, but on the wrong section. <laughs> no. Oh, you technically has wrong section, but think harder. Think harder. I can't think harder. I can only think softer. Softer. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, okay. can, can, does she even know about the thinker clock? I, how she would know? How could she see from that distance of what the weapon was? Uh, there you go. <laughs> Is that it? All right, babe. A clock? Didn't this come up in another testimony recently? Well, don't look so sour, Mr. Lawyer. You can't win them all. No, but I have a feeling I'm onto something now. Uh, so now I think it's evidence. Yeah, you're gonna present something. <sighs> okay, I'm guessing I just have to show the thinker. 
Yo digo, it's like, I remember, like, there's like somehow you do this. <laughs> I, I, it was like a while ago since I played this game. Yeah. Like, I remember Miss May. somehow how to do it. What you said just now was quite revealing. Revealing? Oh, would you like I that? Would you I not forgot even about this part. You just said that this statue of the thinker was a clock. But there was no way of knowing that just by looking at it. <laughs> oh! Another person in, in much the same position as you recently called this a clock, too. And he was found guilty of murder. Order! Order! Where the fuck is my Miss, Big Mac? <laughs> Miss May, can you explain how you know this was a clock? Oh! Oh! The witness saw the murder with their own eyes. That's a, that's all that that's all that's important here. What the fuck is this thing? The best is trying to confuse the issue with trivial concerns. Yes, yes, of course. Do a stronger question, Mr. White. <laughs> no, I think but I... questions are all I have, Your Honor. As you may recall, I've caught murderers with these questions before. Well, only once. I'm here to sustain. You may continue the question of witness. There you go. See, I'm fucking. Woo! That was close. If he stopped me there, the trial would be over. Huh? What? So, what happens now? You will strip! <laughs> <laughs> Do it again. <laughs> what happens now is that you answer my question. How did you know it was a clock? What? That's... Because I heard it? Yes! I heard! It says the time! So you've been to the law offices of Faye and Co. No, no! Hey, I didn't say that! Why would I go there? I heard it from my hotel room. <laughs> it's not that loud. It is not that loud. The law offices... Uh, Faye and Co. Where, where the murder took place is very close to the hotel. Not that close. It's like across the street. She really easily heard the clock. No, she well, That's gotta be one loud-ass clock, then. <laughs> yeah. Well, Mr. Wright, you're satisfied? No, Your Honor. I can't give up now. Round two. I'm not satisfied because she couldn't have heard it. No, she couldn't have heard it. No, there was no way she could have heard it. It, should, it couldn't have rung. God, both are actually kind of good. <laughs> I, I think it doesn't matter here? I don't know. But yeah, she couldn't have heard it from such a distance. You were at the hotel. There's no way you could have heard the clock go off in the building next door. Yeah, have proof of that? Uh, she could not? Uh. Amateur. <laughs> amateurs, amateurs. Listen to me, Mr. Wright. <laughs> in the courtroom, proof is everything. Without it, you have nothing. You are nothing. Then you I should kill like yourself to... now! <laughs> <laughs> then I would like to propose a test to see if she really could have heard it. The prosecution denies your request. Because apparently he can just do that. That's funny. <clears throat> what? On what grounds? On my grounds, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> this is a trivial matter with no direct bearing on the case at hand. Indeed! Objection sustained. Damn. Time to switch directions. Quick. Ready to proceed, Mr. Wright? No, Your Honor. Okay, I guess it couldn't. Oh, okay, then. Your Honor, members of the court. <clears throat> it is inconceivable that the clock in question. That the. Wait, hold on. That the clock in question rang because. His batteries are dead? There's a run of batteries. Huh? Oh, actually, it's plugged, huh? No. No, 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 it's not right. Broken. Yeah, you uh, read the record, uh, the court record. Uh, all right, hold on. Keep looking. Oh wait a minute. Now. Batteries are dead. Didn't matter if the batteries were full or not, you wouldn't be able to hear it because... It's broken. It works fine. 
It's empty. <laughs> yeah, the, the fucking phone call shows it. Uh... Oh, it's not working. So it's not really empty, it's broken. It is empty, she took out the clockwork. No, because that's the paper in it. Yeah. Is that what they mean by empty? Just by the the, the, the whole contraption not being yes, there? Yes, it's empty. The thing that makes it talk is, uh, and everything else was taken out of it. It can, she said it can still speak. It's just missing. <laughs> the clock is missing its clockwork. How could you possibly? Go take a look right now. Mm. Oh. Do you think interesting, Your Honor? It says the fence says. Its clock is missing. Its clockwork. It's quite empty. I'm trying to take this to the back rooms. Don't mind me. <laughs> Mr. Wright? Mm -hmm. Would you care to explain the, to the clock? To the core, the meaning of this. It is as you can see. The clock was empty. It couldn't have rung. Therefore, this witness is a big fat liar. <laughs> <laughs> fat? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. F A T. <laughs> fat. Ass. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> okay, but yeah. Uh, I don't know how much this case is left. We're already at 20 bit, 21 minutes. We'll leave it to the next one. Uh, yeah, there's still a bit more. Yeah, so. Next time. Got Woo! It.